Hi. <laughs> okay. All right. Welcome to our special Splat and Chat today. I have a beautiful guest with me today because she's not at school. She's here with me to paint today. And this tutorial goes out to all the kids out there that are just sitting home being bored, right? That's what we're doing part of it, right? So we thought we'd paint something Eastery today because it's Easter and Easter's fun and springtime, right? Yeah. Makes us happy. <laughs> this is my daughter, Oakley. <laughs> Don't stick your tongue out. Anyway, we're gonna have fun with this. Hopefully this will keep the boredom far away. And you know, you can't go out into the stores right now because to get Easter decorations. So look around your house and you can paint something Easter, right? Yeah. What's with the head banging? <laughs> Did you start painting? Yeah. Yeah? Yeah? Do you like looking at yourself on the camera? No. <laughs> kids, this one's for you. And if you're not a kid, if you're not, yeah, if you're not a kid, you're all kids. If you're not a kid, you can paint too. But this will be fun for spring and you put it in your room. Well, your other ones you could paint for kids too. You can paint all of them for kids. But this one's a specifically, especially, oshmalili for kids today, right? Okay. So let's tell them what colors we need. Do you want to show them? Yes. What colors we need? Okay, first color. We need black. Black. Second color. We need two different colors of green. Two different colors of green. If you don't have two different colors of green, get one color green and make sure you got yellow. Okay. And then got yellow. Yellow. That's for a chick. And then we need white. White. And, and we need this orange. Orangish color. And then we're going to have whatever kind of colors you want for the background. Yeah, for your background sky, you can pick whatever you want. You can pick like a blue sky color, or you can pick a purple, or you can even do the orange coral color. Whatever looks springy and fun to you, okay? And then we need some supplies. What else do we need? Tell them you need some paper uh, towel. Make sure you get some paper towel. We need paper towel. And... A cup full of water. Cup of water. And That's a important. Full, just like a quarter. Yeah, not full, just about this much. And water. then a paper plate with the name on the back. <laughs> <laughs> That's what we've been using all week, huh? Okay. And then you need a pencil, maybe. Um, some brushes. It's brushes. Plenty you guys of got brushes. Some brushes. Get a bunch of fun paint brushes. Specifically a big one. Plenty of And then a smaller paint. one. Whatever you got at home. This Whatever you can find. Big. It'll work. Okay. Should we paint? Yes. <gasps> can they even see that? No. You gotta go right here, silly. Oh. Oh, okay. <laughs> I knocked the cat. Oh, okay. <laughs> The biggest, the biggest brush you can find. Oh. Not the biggest, because then you might get one that's like this big. Right? Oh, that's a big one. Okay, did you get one for you? Yeah, it's over here. Okay, all right. I got all of my brushes. Okay, get your brush wet. Dip it in some water. Dab it off on your paper towel. Are we we'll gonna get do the background first? Yeah, yeah background first. being weird. Get your color that you want to put on the very bottom. Okay, mine's gonna be light, 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 light purple. You need blue because it's the best color. And we gonna do turquoise, huh? Mm -hmm. If. Okay, you got your wet brush? Dry it off a little bit? No. I'm pouring my blue right now. Okay, fill your whole thing in with light color, really light color of what you got. I make brush strokes all over. I so do this. Just go like this and make like crisscrosses everywhere. You make those weird noises because that helps too. That looks weird. Does that? I need a little bit more water. You want to like make yours lighter, or do you like that color? I like it like this. Well, this is the perfect color. Not the perfect color? Very good. Smear it all over the painting. Get your edges. Get your edges too, yes, baby. <sighs> Dry. Okay, get your background painted the color you want and then let it dry for a few minutes. Maybe even blow on it. Well, you should take a, a, a blow dryer and blow it. Blow dryer, that's my secret weapon. Okay, we painted our backgrounds. They look pretty, right? Do they look yes. like spring colors? They do. Fun spring colors and they dry because we use our secret weapon. <laughs> okay, let's do the next part, which is white. Can you get white on your palette? Uh, what brush do we use? This one? Um, we're gonna use the middle, the middle size brush. Okay, the middle size brush. Is this a middle size brush? Uh, that goes smaller. Yeah. Smaller, like. Like this one. Like, 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 like this one is a good size yeah. right there. This kind of size for. Over here, you gotta show. <laughs> I keep forgetting. <laughs> right there. 
Right, this is a medium paintbrush. This is a big paintbrush yeah, and this is a medium. Difference, huh? Okay, you ready, baby? Yeah. Okay, get it wet. Dry it off. Make sure it's dry off really good, though, because this you don't want to be wet at all. I want the white. Okay, put the white on there. I'm going to make some Easter egg shapes, but you're not going to go up real high because you want your chick to be up there, okay? So you're going to do some white eggs right in here. Take the white. White paint. I have a paint. Do you know how to paint an Easter egg? Nope. Just like a circle, but it's got a pointy end. Right? That's weird. No, no, no. So it's like an oval. It's like an oval with a pointy end. Yeah. The pointy end goes into the other man. <laughs> <laughs> what was that on? I don't know. <laughs> Okay, there's our first egg shape. You don't have to worry about the bottom being perfect because it's gonna be covered in grass, but. Can I get right in the middle, like right in here, make your egg but shape. But that's why I'm making my other egg. But your chick is gonna stand on top of the one egg. It is. So you gotta kinda of make the one egg in the middle so the chick can stand on top of it. That makes sense? No. Put your eggs right in the middle, that main big egg and right in the middle so that your chickie can stand on top of it. I could draw this, but I just can't paint it. You can paint it. Oh, yeah. You can do it, you can do it, you can do it, you no, can do you it, yes you can, oh yes you can, uh, there's nothing to it really. Yeah, there is. There's a lot to do it. Look at that cute shaped Easter egg. So cute. Tasher's coming. Bad. No, it's cute. It's called Big Mine is. Mine's Big Easter egg too. <laughs> These are actually the chicky. The chicky? I think the story is the chicky hatched early. He's the first one to hatch in his bed. Or in his nest. And he was the smallest. And, and he, he like, jumped on top of the other eggs. He's like his siblings big. to bug the crap out of them and wake them up out of their eggs. He was like this big compared to the egg. <laughs> no, he's not. He's cute. And okay. He, and he okay, got your egg shape? You got your egg shape cute. right? You good? Okay, keep working. Okay. Okay, there we go. That's cute. Okay, now you're gonna put like another little egg that's kind of tilted into it a little bit. Like, okay. oh, yeah. So it goes kind of like, yeah, you can do two cone that way, or you can do another one kind of sits in like this. Could we make a nest? No, we're gonna do grass. Mm -hmm. These eggs are living in the grass. Yeah, there's the other egg. See, and I'm covered by grass. Down they there. like those birds that lay in the grass, like the tall grass. Sure, some kind of bird that lays in the grass. It's yeah, good. there's like those kind of birds who like lays in the grass. Like not like turtles, but there's like this kind of bird that lays in the grass and lays eggs in like there's the tall grass. There's a kind of bird that has a um, the daddy before he even has the babies. He sits there and makes a nest out of the branches that goes like this. He makes the branches turn together like this and he makes a little hut inside of it. Is that cute? How do you know that? We'll have to look it up and see what bird that is. I remember uh, I read a story about it at school. About that kind of certain bird? Yeah. Certain kind of bird? I don't remember it at all. Because I never listen. <laughs> because you never listen? You better listen. Well, I do. It's Good just, girl. I just forget. Good girl. How do you get rid of that? Just get a little bit of water on your. Gotta get a clean brush. I can get it wet a little bit. Okay, and then I can just erase it. Yeah, I just kind of dab it off on your. There you go. Then just kind of take the water right on top of it a couple times. There you go. Now take off that paint. And that's how you erase it. Take paint. off that paint on your. <laughs> take it off on your paper towel. Oh. There you go. Then come and do it again. There you go. I'm the best at erasing. You can do that while it's wet still, huh? But if after it dries, you can't really do that very well. Okay, there we go. Does that look better? You have okay. the right egg shape? Okay, we're getting some yellow this time. We're going to put it kind of right by our white. There's some yellow, baby. And it's called yellow. Yellow, yellow. Yellow paint that's called yellow. Remember that. Yellow paint that's okay, called Okay, use your same yellow. little brush. <laughs> and we're going to dip it in some yellow and then dip it in white. See what I did on there? I dipped it in yellow and white. So take your middle brush. Why? The one that's clean. Did you get them cleaned out? Okay, dip it in a little bit of yellow. And yellow. And then white. And a little bit of white. Look at my messy palette. I did. Did you get some more white on it? Get a little bit more white on it. There you go. Okay, now I'm going to make a little tiny Easter egg up here. Kind of above your egg. An Easter egg? Yeah, it's like the little body of the chick. Oh, can I just use this plain yellow? See how the white, though, makes some textures in it? It's so cute. But I don't like it. Ooh, mine looks like mustard. 
Can use a little bit more white. And mustard cheeky. Mustard cheeky? Yes, mustard cheeky. See that gives it some texture. It looks like feathers and stuff if you use different colors. See? Isn't that fun? Did you get a circle? I'm adding little fuzzy little feathers. It's kind of, there. it's like an egg shaped circle. Okay, now I'm going to do another one. Get some more white paint on, white and yellow on your paintbrush, okay? And we're going to do a bigger head. I'm making little crazy feathers. Okay, make little crazy feathers. Okay, we're going to do a head on this baby. But Wait, it's that, that be... was the head. No, that's the body. Oh, okay. <laughs> You gotta do another egg shape on top right there. Like this. <laughs> you do it oh, look, his head is way bigger than his body. See how cute oh, it's oh. No, it's cute. It's cute. And you gotta make him so that he's um, still an egg shape. So you gotta make the one part bigger than the other part. Oh, see? It's cute. Yeah, the man. You gotta make it bigger than the body, baby. So they can tell the difference between the head and the body. <laughs> you can't tell the difference on yours. <laughs> you can't tell the difference. Yeah. Make it round because we're gonna put some feathers on it. I promise. This big compared to a big brush. Oakley's done a fuzzy chick and I've done a not so fuzzy chick. <laughs> okay, it's up to you. So you get the two. Okay, so now dip it in yellow and white again. Dip it in yellow and white again. Here we go, ready? Okay. Yellow and white. Very dimmer. We're gonna put the little wings on. Oh my goodness. I'm gonna start right here. Look what I do, Oakley. Watch. Start right here. And then just push it down and drag it in. Oh look at that. You put you start on the outside, sweet. I don't care. <laughs> 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 okay, then do another one right underneath of it. Look how cute this is. I'm gonna have one. Look, like you do it like this things. underneath of it. See, like two little teeny dots. Thank okay. you. On this side, pink. And on this side, a little bit of white and yellow. Look at those cute wings. Aren't those cute? This one needs to be a little thicker. Okay, then you do the same thing on his head, right in the top. He's gonna have this little to get it. Oh, okay. I was like, is he a gonna have a feather wings? on his head? Oh, see how cute he is. Two on each side, two wings. And one little thing at the top. And rinse your brush. And Chicky has humongous wings. Yours has humongous wings, huh? Mm -hmm. Cute. You have to put a little tutti dot at the top of his head. A little feather. A little feather at the top of his heather. Okay, put some green on your palette. Oh, that's cute. Oh, he's got three, huh? <laughs> <laughs> That's cute. Okay, put some greens on your palette. We're gonna make the grasses around it. Darker green. Or if you don't have two greens, just do start with green. <laughs> and then we'll add some yellow to it. So take your paintbrush like this on the side and well, just kind of drag it up. Well, you could just add some white to some green. That'd be See how cute this is? Just start on the bottom like grass grows. And with the cut. dark one? Mm-hmm. Okay. I have a big lobby. Ooh. Oh, oh you that was a monkey lolly, but then we did not out. Okay, you can do tall, tall grasses behind your eggs, in front of your eggs. I need to move that paint over. Get out of the way, little eggies. <laughs> All across the tall tongue. grass. Whoa, that is some tall grass. Make sure you paint the grass onto the sides too, because that'll make it look finished. And along the bottom too. Get your bottom too while you're at it down there, huh? You don't want to bury your eggs in grass, do ya? I do. You do? You can yeah. make some come out from behind the eggs. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's that cute. Behind the egg. I'm gonna have to change, touch it up and white again. Okay, now if you don't have a lighter green, or at this point I want to add a little bit of light green to it, but if you don't have lighter green, just take a little bit of yellow and mix it in with your dark green that you have already. Well, you're probably still with me. And that I'm makes... I'm still doing the grass. <laughs> still doing the grass. And that makes it kind of a lighter green. So, add a couple of touches of light green in there. Look how fun the light green makes it kind of pop. Is that fun? I have tall grass because I'm being one of the realistic people. The realistic green grass. Yeah. Ooh, -hoo, so cute, so cute. Make sure you got taller and shorter grasses in there because it looks better, right? Wizroom, wizroom. Okay, there we go. You can go. go gigantic grasses like Oakley, right? <laughs> <laughs> Giant grass. Because. 
bird like this grow their eggs uh, or laid their eggs in tall grass. Yep, fill all those little empty spaces. Those little empty spaces, fill them all in with green grasses. All well, the I'm going to fill that in with the light gray. Okay. Oh, look at that light green color. Isn't that fun? I'm doing that somewhere else. It looks like seaweed. That's cute. <laughs> no, look at the long and straight green grasses. That's good. If you make them wiggly grasses, then they look like seaweed. Ooh. Yeah, don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. It's bad. Bad idea. Bad idea. Bad. Bad. Bad out there. Okay, where have you got an empty space? Fill that one with light green. I am a mushy. That looks like a cute little cozy nest you made. It's got tall, tall grasses and then little short ones for the legs and the nest goes. It's cute. The bird cut down those so Chop you can off his see beak. it. No, it he lawn mowed it with his <laughs> beak. <laughs> yeah, he's like, you need to see the eggs. <laughs> Can't have a perfect, perfect family picture. <laughs> All right, grab out some orange. We have a pretty coral orange just because it's a little bit more pastel -y and eastery. I chose it out. Regular orange. I chose it out. I have a yeah, more Oku beautiful scent than her. <laughs> oh, yeah? You get a Here's blobby. the corally orange color. She gets real, a blobby. <laughs> it's not real Halloween orange looking. Anyway, just need a little bit of that. Okay, so take, <laughs> take, take the smallest brush you can find, darling. Or you can have this kind of orange. Yeah, that one. Jack o' lantern. This is Jack o' lantern. That's Halloween orange. Okay, use that one. And I'll use this one. Get it wet. Really skinny brush here, okay? Skinny, skinny little brush. Skinny. Get it wet and dry it off. This is the normal brush of small, and then this is the other one. So it's very skinny. Okay. <laughs> Take your little brush and make a little triangle right here. Oh, is that the speak? Uh huh. Look how cute that is. A little triangle. Up, up, up a little bit. Up. Like right where the speak would be. Oh. Kind of up a little bit. Like, no, that's the wrong kind of triangle, babe. You gotta make the, what are you busy doing? Talking? He's <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> Okay. You can do whatever you want. <laughs> really. Okay. That's more like a beat though if it's one triangle, silly goose. Ah, I'm gonna put a tongue right there. Oh, you are, huh? Yeah, with red. Okay. <laughs> Wouldn't tell them that you had red. <laughs> well, they don't have to do it. Okay. Of course they're gonna have red. Okay, now you make his little feet. So you can bring this little, le little long leg down like this, and the little long leg down like this. Whoosh, whoosh. Yeah. And then you put little, like, um, Pitchforky looking things. Go one, two, three. Like those hands that little kids make on stick guys. Yeah. There he is. Oh, look how cute. Mine look like weird. They're gripping. <laughs> <laughs> Yours look Mine cuter. looks like it has a little <laughs> disco party. I want to make him a little necklace and be like, uh -huh. oh yeah, a little uh -huh. necklace too. Uh -huh. And then he's gonna have a party hat on oh, the side of his hand right there. Interesting. My my bird is gonna have a whole party. Okay, give him get some black on your palette. Just a little bit of black, all you need. Sure, black. My black. Look, you can give him little knobby knees. Should we give him little knobby knees? <laughs> 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 I don't have any room to put my black. I don't think chicks have knobby knees, do they? Yeah, they do. They do? Oh, then we're perfect. <laughs> okay, that's plain black, dude. I'm gonna borrow some of your black. That's plain black. No. Yeah. No. So you just get little tiny no! black on your paintbrush. And you make two little eye With egg, the tiny egg brush shapes. again. Two little eye eggs. Can't even see, it's too fuzzy. Making a lot of eggs in this painting. <laughs> kind of close together. Oh. That's a big eye. <laughs> I told you, he was having a party. <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> He's having a party, huh? Because oh, it's Easter. Okay. He's yeah. having a party because it's Easter. Do whatever you want, darling. That's why I put so much black on. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. I have blue on my arm. <gasps> there. Saved by the mommy. And the apron. <laughs> okay. All right. He looks a little sad right there. Oh. <laughs> he looks a little sad. You gotta make him. Um... Ooh. Ooh, yeah. Give it put some little white or something right there to make him look happier later, huh? 
Okay, now. Yeah, last thing. Just put a little bit of bite in the eyeball. You called it, darling. You need to dry first. Mine looks bad. Oh, look. There oh, he has oranges. <laughs> got a little yellow, huh? Oh, there we go. Last touch, a little di white dot in his eyeball. Mine are big. Oh, yes! Oh, yes! <laughs> oh, yes! Is that his eyelids? <laughs> <laughs> no, that's not his eyelids. With the little googly eyes, they put a, they put a dot with another little oh, dot. Oh, I see, I see. He's cute. He looks a little ornery. <laughs> he's like, what am I doing? He's so tilted. He's like giving somebody the stink eye. <laughs> yeah. he's like, we are done with our cute little Easter chick. Wasn't what? that fun? Except for Oakley's not done because she's going to add a necklace and a party hat. And what else are you going to add? She doesn't know yet. But anyway, we'll let you see hers when it's all finished. You guys can add whatever you want to your little chickie as well. And yeah, have fun with them. Yeah, have fun. Happy Easter. She's being crazy again. Just turn off the video right now and leave. <laughs> <laughs> Here is our Easter chick on colored eggs. See how cute that is? Yeah, it's way better than just one. And a big eggs. bunny. That's one hey. of the ones you can find on my Etsy store. But hey, wh why would you come on my face? Good. These are the finished versions. How's yours look? Does and it look as cute? The banner. I was going to do a party, but and the cheek was in the way, so I just wrote fun. <gasps> look at this. Oakley added a necklace, a party hat, a banner that says fun. And what else do you have in there? Is that all of them? Yeah. Cute. You guys can add whatever you want. I thought it would be cute to add some little critters in the grass. You could do like it. What I what we say? Ladybug and caterpillar. Yeah, ladybug or caterpillar. That'd be fun. Add whatever you want. Hopper. Have fun with it. We'll see you next time. Bye.